Hey guys, hey guys. So it is a 5.53, which is 6 o'clock, and I'm on my way home. I've been out all day. I still ain't got home to take the stress of the shit out my backseat of my car, but um, I stopped by here. Hold on, let me show y'all. It's a little hole in the wall, uh, Mexican food place, but I heard good things about it. I really did. I heard great things about this place. So, um, I got, my husband has some friends coming over, some friends coming from LA, Ugh, okay, but whatever. He got some friends coming from LA, and he's on his way to pick them up now, and so I just got everybody corner side of burritos and call it a day and then I got my kids a corner side of taco and then y'all my fat ass I got a corner side of some corner side of chili cheese fries okay now if I can't eat that I also order bean and cheese burrito with sour cream all that shit is mushy so I should be able to eat it you know so we'll see um, yeah, so that's what I got. That's going to be dinner. You know what I'm saying? That's going to be dinner. They're going to eat that when they get in the house and, uh, get a dessert and call it a day. So that's how that day is going. Day is almost 10. We did pretty good. I got the goal that I, I had set for myself today. I got that taken care of, which was to get us absolutely prepared for, the shutdown, and we are. I even went to CVS and got some bleach and some more um, hand hand sanitizer, a big one. I tried to get alcohol. They didn't have any. Um, I'm going to have to go somewhere else to get alcohol. And then I got um, trash bags, you know, just things that, you know what I'm saying, that I would need uh, that, you know, if you know, because I'm not coming out at all. If they tell me to stay my ass at the house, and I'm staying my ass at the house, and y'all going to be seeing a lot of me, because I ain't going to have shit else to do. So I'm not really worried about it. Um, I may, my hair appointment is Monday, or either Tuesday, whichever one. So I may, if they ain't closed it down, by this week coming, I'm going to go ahead and get my hair done, and get a feel on my nails before they shut it down so yeah and that's it i'm glad i just i'm happy this time that we know about it then it just happening and we didn't know about it and a lot of people did not get that letter you know what i'm saying so i don't know that's why i don't know if it's real or not you know what i'm saying but um i'm going to act like it is real it's, it can't hurt me you know what i'm saying to prepare my fat my home it can't hurt me so I'm just, it can't hurt me to prepare my hair, to prepare my nails. If it's not, it's not. If it is, it is. You feel me? Um, yeah, so at least I got everything I needed for the house. I even got me a sound bar, guys, for my bedroom. Because I'm a movie person. And I have, I don't know if I showed you guys, I have a theater in my house. But a small theater, y'all. Not nothing real. I turned my loft into a theater room. So let me just say that. But, um, fuck it. It's my theater, okay? But anyways, um... And, it, and then they put the um, sound system inside the theater so it makes you feel like you're in the movies because I love loud, dramatic stuff. So, But my bedroom television is loud, but it is not like boom, boom. So what I did was is get a sound bar. So I'm hoping I got my handyman with me. So hopefully he can put it up for me. And it'll sound really good. So when I watch my movies, it could be boom, boom, boom. Because, you know, I'm getting everything I need to be in the house for two weeks. Okay, I got me a sound bar so I can be watching all type of movies. And the good thing is I got direct cable, dish or direct. No, I got dish or direct. I got one of them. I can't remember. I think I got dish. Turn your phone down. I think I got dish. One, you got a satellite. One, you don't. Direct. I think I got direct. Anyway, regardless, I got one of these cables. <laughs> 
and they have good little movies for like five dollars you know on pay-per-view yeah so like i didn't see bad boys three you know so i can go catch up on that and little things that's out if you guys know any good movies that has happened and you think i haven't seen them please comment down below that it's the shit like it's the shit i'm gonna need something to do also tomorrow I'm going to go to Borders because I love to read. Like, Joyce Myers uh, has a workshop book. So, you know, I'm just going to keep myself busy. Like, if I can't move around, then I like to keep myself busy in the house. I don't mind staying in the house if, if I'm content. As long as I got goodies, snacks, food, good TV, good phone, good book, good all that, I, I can stay in the house. I, I'm, I, you know, I have no issue. So, uh, you know, I'm going to go to uh, Borders. And get uh, Joyce Myers got a good workshop book, and um, try to get some little spiritual books or whatever the case may be. That's what I'm gonna try to do tomorrow, and then I'm gonna go to Target tomorrow. I didn't go today because I'm too tired. Uh, Sam's Club wore me out, honestly. So I'm gonna go to um, Target tomorrow. I got the game, the kids a lot of board games and all that, but I want to go get like little paint um coloring books colors um just little things that fill in their life too um you know what i'm saying i'm even they have tablets but i'm thinking yeah. even of getting them like my boys one of those um sega genesis Net, Net, nintendo handheld thing um i'm thinking about even doing that because They've been going out, y'all. Y'all know. Every day they go out. And so to be able to, to just immediately just cut that off is going to drive them crazy, me crazy, and TT crazy. Okay? So, um, you know, if I can prepare myself and prepare them, we'll be good. My husband, he got to get a lot of marijuana because last time when we had this shit closed down, the delivery people took four to five hours to deliver the weed i don't smoke y'all he do and it was super expensive so normally like a well i live in vegas so this weed is just expensive period so i don't want to start saying prices because i really don't know about weed but it was so it was like three times more of, than what it would have normally been that's number one and it was um Four to five hours to get it delivered. So he needs to prepare himself. Shit. Just give me a heads up. Now, mind you, if we're not on lockdown, cool. But if we are, I need to be comfortable, baby. My whole house. Because they'll get on my nerves. See, you feel me? Make everybody around you comfortable so then you can truly be comfortable. Because if you just make yourself comfortable, everybody around you ain't going to be comfortable. They're going to irritate you. Then you won't be comfortable. Okay? So, yeah, so I need to definitely call him. Matter of fact, when I get off the phone with y'all, I'm going to call him and tell him that tomorrow he needs to be up early and get as much weed from the weed dispensary as possible. That will cover him for three weeks. Now, I don't know how much that is. And if it's illegal, then I didn't mean to say that. But also, he's, he, he, he's a vapor, weed vapor, too. So get, like, five of them. Get a lot of weed. Get all your blunts. Get all your shit. Because you're not going to get on my nerves. Mm-mm. So that, you know, I'm trying to think about everything. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I got the food. I got the tissue. I got the hand sanitizer. I got all that shit. I'm finna now. I got all, the, like, the main important shit. Now, tomorrow will be the miscellaneous shit. The activities and the marijuanas and the, you know what I'm saying? The books and all that. That's going to be tomorrow. Today, I had to get the main shit out because I got to tell y'all, I'm out here in Las Vegas. And even though I have siblings, I don't, my grandparents and my family is in California, which is four hours away. So I always move like I'm by myself. You know, I don't have no house to go to to call nobody if I'm out of this or I'm out of that. Because, mind you, my siblings are younger than me, and they don't think like I think. So, they're not going to have the shit. So, I have to think for, for them as well. I, that's why I went and got a lot of tissue. 
Um, because I'm probably gonna have to be giving their house the tissue if worse comes to worse. You feel me? So yeah. I have to think about all that stuff. You know? But um yeah, so I don't know. I just hope that this that this lockdown really gets in people's mind to put your fucking mask on. Like to me it's not it, it doesn't bother me to put my mask on. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't bother me um at all because I don't want to get sick. I don't. It's nothing, you know, I don't. But anyways, guys, I got to go. Talk to you later. Bye.